Hey folks, it's IOE throwing we're back with some more Reddit. Um so some of you have been requesting longer videos and some of you just want more Reddit content. Um and I'm getting subscribers from people uh who find my Reddit content. So I've been looking into some of the more uh I don't know about smaller subreddits, but just uh, subreddits I haven't visited before. And since Minecraft it doesn't want to work for me today, so you guys aren't getting a Minecraft video. We're going to do Reddit instead. Um, excuse me if I need to make any dramatic cuts here, or whatever. It'll be because I suddenly start dying and coughing. That's fine. So this is Accidental Slapstick. Um, and from the few I have seen already, yeah, it should be a lot of fun. So we're just going to scroll down to number 20. And 3, 2, 1, go! Oh, I know. Yeah. So <laughs> they all just went when he said go, but of course the bar wasn't down yet, and so it didn't matter that he said go because the bar didn't go down. Their bikes didn't go anywhere. That is good. Slide physics. Now, if you have to let physics slide, oh, but poor kid. I'm guessing it was a hot day, and that his legs were sticking to the slide, and it it just it made a really amazing video. But that must have hurt a lot. <laughs> Anyways, the amazing flying disc. Oh. Oh. That's cool. Oh. So, um, um, <laughs> who's, who's going down to get that one back? Or do you, do you just call it a write-off at that point in time? Because, I mean, there's a manhole right there. You could definitely go get it back. However, it's going to be so gross. I don't know. I I think, personally, uh, I would just consider it to be a write-off. Because, yeah, right? <laughs> Pow! Right in the kisser. Yeah, I don't see how this could possibly be bad. Oh! When I saw the guy jump on the skateboard, I'm like, wait. How is he going to get hit right in the mouth doing this? Well, apparently, he's in fact going to bend down at the same time as popping the skateboard up. And more or less clock himself in the mouth. Good job. <laughs> oh. Yeah... This just makes me sad sometimes. <laughs> Thinking a lily pad can support the weight of my body. I've oddly enough never been in this situation. Why would you... Yeah. It... It may be big and, and beautiful, but... It, it's still... I mean, it's a plant. Floating on the surface of the water. What, what, what did you think was going to happen? Well, obviously, she thought she could walk across them like some sort of ninja. No, that's that's not how lily pads work, though. They're they're not. Um, you can't make them into nin ninja makers. A new a new take on the classic water bucket gag. This is supposed to be accidental slapstick, so. Oh no! Yeah, he definitely doesn't. Uh oh 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 yeah 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 just and the worst part is like he was only like an inch or two too high but that was enough and then he just like it, it all went bad 
You know, I can't help but wonder why you were trying to move three boxes of water. In addition, how is it that the water wasn't just going to slosh on out while you were in transit? Unless this was supposed to be a prank? And you pranked yourself? Um, hilarious skateboard fall. All skateboard falls are hilarious, though, so... Oh! Oh! Oh, that's gonna smart for a while. Oh! Oh, yeah. Well, I mean, upside... You weren't facing the other way. If you'd been facing the other way, we'd still be able to hear the screams. So, you know, take it with, um, you know, silver linings, right? Oh, more, oh, I was going to say more skateboarding. That's up here. We got sandboarding between here and there. Yeah, I don't know how this could possibly go wrong. Sandboarding as a family. Oh! Well, yeah, of course, that's... And, you know, that kid was like, the kid was like, I'm just going to go by myself, Dad. You can't stop me. And the rest of the family was like, okay, Dad, we'll, we'll just go all together on the carpet. It's fine. And the one kid up front... Yeah, he was showing off right when it happened. He was like, watch, I can only do this one-handed. Yeah, that's not quite the what you were thinking you wanted to happen, huh? Skate skateboarding down a ramp while it's lit on fire. Why? I mean, no, I know why. I was a teenage boy once myself. Apparently, it's a crossbow from what could go wrong. Did he splash gasoline on him on his legs? And this is not a ramp. This is a rock. Which I understand. And they're lighting his little pants on fire. All oh, you got to be kidding me. Okay, so, for all of you kids out there, the answer is never to run around like a moron. The answer is stop, drop, and roll. And if that's what these guys had just done to begin with, the second guy there probably burned his hands doing this garbage. And I mean, oh yeah, look at the amount. So much gasoline was put on his pants. No wonder. And then they waited so long. So, for those of you who may not realize, um, gas doesn't burn. Gasoline does not burn. Gasoline fumes burn. So the longer that gas was sitting there producing fumes, the more flammable this idiot became. Yeah. Okay. Let's jump right up into textbook slapstick acting. I really hope this has to do with a textbook. And this isn't an unfortunate name. What? So... He obviously loses track of it. It comes back, bounces off his head. And then we also get the champagne spray. And the kid next to him who's like, Oh, I got missed by the cork. Oh. <laughs> there wasn't a textbook. I'm less happy. Pulling out a tree. I 
I feel somehow like he's got to be doing part of this on purpose, right? Nobody's going to be dumb enough to hit themselves in the head repeatedly with a tree. Right? I'm fairly certain that that is going to be the, the title of the video. Hitting yourself repeatedly with a tree. I'm just going to take a quick sip. Yeah, this isn't going to end badly at all. Oh, it's a bird. Oh, oh yeah. So, on a related note to that, I have, um, when I grew, grew up, I grew up in a house with four cats and a dog, and more than one occasion, I've seen a cat get their whole head stuck in a glass while trying to drink out of the bottom of it, and then start running around the house with a, a no, it was a plastic cup, thankfully. Stuck their heads, which was just hilarious. But the best ever was when my giant of a dog, um, Labrador Retriever, but still quite big, um, decided to stick her head and nose into a little tiny plastic cup because there was water at the bottom of it. Yes, she could have just gone downstairs to her water bowl, which is always full. And drank out of that. But no, she decided she was going to drink the little bit of water at the bottom of this cup. She jammed her muzzle so far into this cup that I had trouble getting it back off after I caught her. Because she was not happy and having none of this and definitely not seeing one but the place. It was... I almost died of laughter. Poor dog had that immediate, immediate regret on phrase though. Instant regret. Guy just trying to help. Wait, what? Guy was just trying to help to flip over the truck. Flip the truck over. So one guy is. Okay, so it's a ton of firefighters. And then. Yep, a couple of extra guys step in. And there goes. Oh! And the one guy was still holding him. Yeah. So, all the professionals know exactly the point they need to let go of the vehicle. The one... One or two of the guys aren't professionals, and he didn't know. And into the vehicle he goes, and then it starts rolling away. Which could have been... I mean... Oh, that would have been... I, I highly doubt it does what I was hoping. I, I kind of like hope it would do, which was like roll partly down the hill and accidentally drop him out. But um, that was still. Right? Nintendo showing off the new Mario Kart graphics. Somehow, I get the feeling this isn't about Nintendo. Oh. Oh. Wait, what? Okay, so... Radio-controlled bike with a monkey on it. And the bike takes out a random kid. Okay. I mean... Somebody's... Definitely had fault there, but I mean, because the monkey wasn't driving, right? It was in the idiot in charge of the radio controlled bike. But, uh, extreme kayaking. This, oh, yeah, you get to this point. Uh, you're a little toast there, dude. Aw, oh, it ends too early. There's got to be a look of, like, defeat on his face. Because he spends all this time shimmying over the edge. Yeah. Oh. Right? 
There's got to be that, oh, after he gets it over. Mm. I mean, kayaking looks like a lot of fun. And if my knees would let me sit in that kind of position for long enough to do it, I probably would. But maybe do it on some on some uh, some not man-made things so that you don't get those right angles that seem to defeat kayaks so so easily. Three or sorry sorry one two three. There was intent, apparently. Okay. So the mom shows them how to dive. And then the kid. Yep. And then the other kid. Bah! I couldn't. I couldn't help it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I need to put a jump cut in there. Oh, I need to write it down though before I forget. Wow. Uh it was uh it was so funny my coughing got tripped off and I could couldn't stop. Kid's extremely excited for his friend's birthday. Oh, this kid is extremely excited. I'm guessing they're singing him a song or something. Oh, as he gets up, he kicks this chair out from under him. Right? So we're watching the red chair. Yep. Yep. As he gets up, knees snap back. Where's his hair? There's his hair. Uh, and he kicks the chair out from under him. So that's... I mean, it's cute. It's definitely cute. But it's not like the evil level of hilarity that we're hoping for with this subreddit. Which is maybe why it's not as popular as some of the others. But this is evil straw, so hopefully. He just like he tries to play it off. <laughs> no, dude, you just stuck a straw up your nose because you weren't paying attention and apparently forgot where your mouth is. <laughs> Realism in video games. Oh, oh, that's a good. Um, well, mix, mix as well with the rest of the channel. Okay. Oh. I'm okay. It was a weird, weird one, but but okay. I understand why it's accidental slapstick. I just didn't think it was that funny, considering it was a video game, and so it's possible that. You've seen that sort of interaction before and decided to do it again, kind of thing. Going down the same stairs as the guy who just f fell down them. Well, I understand why this is top of all time. <laughs> so it must be freezing rain. And that guy falls. And so the second guy's like, I know what I'm doing. I will just simply walk down these stairs exactly the same as the first guy who just got himself killed going down these stairs. Yep. And the phone. Oh, man. Um. You don't see too many white Samsung phones. So that was probably an Apple that just flew down those stairs. Assuming, of course, that it's one of the two and not some other brand I don't know about that is mainly white. Um, but, man, that is probably the death of a beautiful smartphone. And a do of 
how they they play it off when they get to the bottom. It's not like they're like they don't like stand up and like oh I guess the the first guy sits there, watches the second and fall. But there isn't like any like looking around and being all like, Oh, we're idiots sir or anything like that. There's just acceptance and then moving on. Okay. Well, we've hit the top um for today and the end of this video. Please leave comments if you guys enjoyed this. Um I'm gonna definitely do more Reddit stuff. I will I'm thinking about getting into the pro revenge um subreddits because those are a lot of fun. Um and I just gotta figure out how to do the text wall thing. Without being text wall, right? But yes. Thank you all for watching. Have a great day. This is IOE Throughout.